Um, but it feels very like secretive, very like hidden. Uh, I like I feel like there was somebody that was killed in this room, two men, altercation, and um, the one guy is like standing over the body of the other one, like, oh my God, oh my God, I killed him. Oh my God, I killed him. And then he decided to pack up the body and go bury it. I feel to the left-hand side of my shoulder here, a sensation of being pushed. Um, I do not feel welcomed in this room. Um, what's it with these kids under the bed? My goodness gracious. <laughs> so we got a closet and we got hanging earlier. I don't know if this is it, but I don't, this closet is. I just heard a man's voice say, what do you want? Yeah, this is not, I feel like I'm gonna And there's a girl, oh, um, would you say this is the most haunted room? Yeah. Okay. Well, besides the room behind Yeah, us. no, the one behind, I already felt that. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. Yeah. It's almost like where the people came to, uh, where the spirits came to just uh, die. Um, I mean, they're like, this was insane back here. They're waiting for... I just hear knocks. They're tired of waiting. Knocks. So they feel like this, they, this is going to help them have closure with families. And they're saying, I'm sorry. On their knees crying. Please don't. I'll get you the money. I'll get you the money. Sir, can you show me anything that would help to identify you or to help you? But I feel, for whatever reason, this room, out of all of the rooms in, in Hotel Apache, this room feels like it has the most stuck energy, um, like a congregation of spirits that.